Um, I think I ran a pretty good one, you know. I'm uh, working with what I got, you know, getting out there and having fun. And, you know, my job was to make it to the finals, and that's what I did. Got a lot of lot load this uh, weekend, so just trying to take it race by race and day by day. You know your hardest? Or did you ease up a I definitely ease up a little bit. I mean, uh, it would have been nice if I hit the 10-9, but it's okay. You know, I only had to get top two, so didn't want to pull all my eggs in the basket in the beginning. When you're running right next to Octavius, you two are neck and neck right next to each other ahead of everybody. Is it hard not to want to beat her and want to win and, and to just realize the situation that this is just about preparing yourself for Friday? As a competitor, you always want to get out there and go for it, but uh, you got to be smart, you know, and I definitely have learned that, you know, with this load that I have, I can't be immature like I used to, and I have to, you know, learn how to run rounds, and that's what I'm trying to do. about Jetta, 11.14? Man, I'm so proud of her. You know, one thing I did tell her, I said, as long as you push and get out, you're going to make it. And, you know, she listened, she got out the block, she executed, and she did well. How big is her doing that again on Friday? How important is that for your team and the team members? You know, it definitely take a little of the load off my shoulders. You know, I'm, I'm carrying two big sandbags right now, so it definitely helped me a little bit in that 100 when I'm a little lighter if she gets in with me. How do you feel about the 4x1 in this? Um, scary. You know, we, we, we stretched the zones this weekend. You know, it paid off and we, we did pretty good. So I'm glad we got the stick off. We dropped our time and we're ready to rock and roll. How about the team overall today? It looks like you guys didn't miss a beat. I mean, we, we, we set a goal. You know, we're really hungry. And, you know, I'm not the only one that has a line that's ready to get out. The whole team is hungry. And so we're definitely ready to, you know, get out there and put on the show for our fans. Cause like I said, they deserve this. What extra advantage does being at home get for you guys? It just gives you that, that extra push, you know. Uh, hearing them, you know, scream when my name is shout out, you know, definitely, you know, gives me a better edge, pumps, pumps me up a little bit more. So, you know, I'm just glad me being home. And like I told my teammates, and my teammates tell me this is my second home. So I love being here. I love my Oregon fans, and I love Hayward Magic.